Julia. George. Julia. And Julia. And Mr. and Mrs. Clooney. This way, George and the mom. Oh, so nice. Guys, universal. No, we don't fight. We life. don't fight, and we don't even pretend to hate each other. No, we, we just actually, openly love each other. Yeah, exactly. No, we have a very funny relationship over the years and I can always the truth of the matter I could make a lot of jokes but the truth is that my family and my wife and my kids uh, uh, Julia and her family are, are their family so that's the truth I would I hate saying it because it's nice in front of the cameras but it, but it is fun to make jokes about me yeah, too. It is fun to <laughs> yeah make you're jokes good at it it's crazy I don't even know how to describe how I feel when I walk onto set with them and I think as a person and an actor I learned so much and being able to learn from them and just to be kind of a sponge on set and soak up everything they do whether it's just their their kindness with everybody or um, their professionalism and uh, just being in awe of, of the two of them. I mean, I was so excited to be a part of this project. Um, I think what this movie is, it shows love from sort of two, dis two different perspectives, two different um, generations, and I think that that's, it's also just a really good time. Um, this is the kind of movie that really warms your heart and makes you feel good. And for the Jurassic Park ride. Looking up top for a few right here. There it is. Thank you. Uh, oh, oh my god, already love. Man love <laughs> the best love. <laughs> yes. So yeah, well he helped me a lot, you know, so because I came from Indonesia, it's such a new thing for me, you know, so um, uh, we were roommates at one point, so he, he gave me like some advices or like just actually just being comfortable in the environment. And I think it's such a feel-good movie after such a long time, you know. Uh, Rom-com I think has kind of, I don't know, it was gone for a moment, you know. I think we're bringing it back to the to the market, you know, to the whole, you know, people has been missing this. It's uh, it's a feel good movie. It's an escape as well. Billy! Billy, Billy, right here, Billy. It's such an escapist, fun, good time. Like, I love a heavy show. I love a heavy movie. But I love a beautiful beach. I love some beautiful people. There are the beautiful people over there. You know, like this movie is just so much fun, and I feel like we all need that right now. And we need it on the big screen because waves don't look as big on iPads. <laughs> we were in Australia filming this super fun movie. Like, if you weren't having a good time, you're kind of a piece of, you know what? <laughs> Lucas! Lucas on your left side! Lucas, 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 Lucas! It feels amazing to, to you know, arrive on set, not even talking about the conditions, like being in Australia in the summer and, uh, and and to get to work with actors you've admired for so long and th that turned out to be the most generous, nice, open, open-hearted um, actors I've ever worked with. It gives you a lot of fuel for the rest of your career. This is a beautiful location, amazing actors, a beautiful friendship, love, uh, fun, uh, there's everything in it. If you want to forget your obligations and, uh, you know, uh, this is why this industry was invented in the first place, to provide entertainment and escapism. Paul Schreifall! And sir, and sir, on the left. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, look at that, Paul. Congratulations. It's nice to be in a big room and laugh with lots of friends. It's a happy thing that we've all been denied for a couple of years, so that would be a good thing to do. When you get your dream cast, what is that like? Terrifying. Nothing but terrifying. Then you realize, luckily, they're really lovely as well as really good. But um, I couldn't get out of bed on the first day. I was just uh, terrified lying there. But then you think, this is what my 21-year-old self dreamt of. Do you know what I mean? Precious a privilege. So, um, yeah, all right, in the end.